da 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 Yeah. Right. Uh, where... Oh, where, oh, where was the church? It was up here. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, I am the great magician Sheree. Now watch me light fire from nowhere. Thank you, I'll be here for a couple of hours. You want to see some magic? Putish. It's magic, friends. Magic. Anything here? On left. I've already got it. How much point? Moving on. Yeah, you're here. Good. Oh, truly, this power is the stuff of miracles. Hmm, it looks like he really can't sense us at all. I shall worship this sacred water with all my being. And I shall not drink oh, it. Venerable Uno, I am yet inexperienced, but would that I could serve thee for all eternity. I just know I'm... How did he know his name's Uno? <laughs> but he is earnest. I'll at least give him that. What was that? I feel like a sort of wind just blew right through me. The blessing has returned to this town. Hooray! This town is now under my domain. You look but very in order happy to maintain it. the blessing, I will need cooperation from the people. Indeed, there are all kinds of methods besides prayer that one can use to uphold the blessing. Like? For example. I see. I'll be sure to give it a try. This sure sounds like a pain to me. Oh, uh, what do I have to do? I will do what little I can. Hmm? What's wrong? I can still feel a powerful malevolence. Oh, there's that word again. And it's not far off. It's somewhere in town. It's up there. In the roof. That's the royal palace. So this is a conversation with the Seraphim? A bunch of lunatics talking to themselves out loud? Finally! You are? I'm Dave. <laughs> hmm. I am a messenger from Chancellor Bartlow of the Highland Government. I have come to invite Saray to a private dinner conference in light of his great suffering for the sake of Lady Lake. Oh, a dinner date. Have you been watching over Saray? Not at all. In fact, I was quite surprised. That the Princess of Highland, as distant as her claim to the throne may be, would have relations with the Shepherd that are so... intimate. I'm sure this news will please your beloved subjects to no end, Your Highness. If you are insinuating that... Alicia! Does it make a difference? Where to? Roundable Palace. Roundable? Oh! Very well. Tell Bartlow I accept his proposal. Please, you mustn't get involved with the Chancellors. I can feel it from them. The malevolence does seem to be coming from them. I apologize for being so weak. Don't worry, it's true. We really do want to see what's going on at the palace. Let's go! It'll be our first time. You'll have to be our guide. Just as you have been to me. 
Come on! Let's go! Blessing for... Blah. Blessing for Lady Lake region has been restored. Lords of the Land. It is now possible to access the Lord of the Land menu from save points in areas where the Lord of the Land has been unlocked. Fighting battles in those areas will raise the blessing level. Depending on the grade you receive... Ah, okay, fair enough. Grade will automatically count towards blessing level. When you touch a save point as the blessing level goes up, you will gain access to boons with variety... Vari... Vari... Bleh. Uh, various, that's the one. Effect. Nice to know. Oh god, here we go. More tutorials. Save point tra Ah! I can travel now! Yes! Spend gal to move between save points you have previously visited. Enable va variant. Oh, I can't even speak today. Enable various boons. Boons available depending on the last level. Items offering. Offer up items for grade. Okay, fair enough. Good it seems know. there's a treasure chest near us. Is there? Ooh. Ooh. Nope, not this way. I'm lost! Wait, that's... No, there's two. Get away. Damn, it's locked. Right, what about this one? Can I open this one? <gasps> can I? Can I, can I, can I? Aww. Damn it! You got a funny icon above your head. What can I do? All of my money. Okay, I don't care. Moving on to the palace. I'm stuck. Damn it, move. Yeah. Yeah, I can travel now. I knew it was going to be a thing. Right. Uh, palace up here. Sucks for merchants. They won't be able to go anywhere. They're having devil... I have a lot of time trying to fix the bridge. Let's go! To the palace! To the star! See these these council members. Come on, Alicia, catch up! What's next? What's this about? I have an invitation. Forgive me, Lady Alicia. Lord Bartlow's orders were to allow Shepard Saray through. We didn't know he'd have a companion. <laughs> His Eminence Lord Bartlow is with a visitor at the moment. Please accompany me to the waiting room. This way. Why do these knights sound like really posh people? Weird. I cannot believe this. Gotcha. All right. What if? All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. Oh, that's the button. There you go. Lead the way, sir. I'm so close to you. Can you hear me breathe on your neck? Oh, yeah, we have to follow people. Do, 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 do. So, I was the wife. I was the family. Thank you. It's been a great conversation. Please, wait here for the time being. Whoa. Ah. Alright, I have to talk to people. Set point! Yay! Just annoy people! Yay! Let's... What's uh, that? What's what? The book? Oh. I'm a Ah, I found a bookshelf. 
Whoa! There's like infinite books! Just oh. what you'd expect from a royal palace. Quite a collection of rare and valuable tomes. Lots that deal with history and ancient relics, too! Oh, I just want to sit and read them all! Uh, oh my! This book has an interesting title. Mad Screams of Kabusutra. Love. A poetry book, maybe? <laughs> Let's check it out. Yeah, careful! It's gonna look like the book's floating in midair! Don't worry, Alicia will hand wave it away for us somehow. Oh, for... Uh, here, gimme. I'll hold it. Wow, Mad is right. An ode to young passions, a lonely voice, screaming love and anguish to the heavens. You just know the author's gonna look back at this ten years later and cringe. Angsty doesn't even begin to cover it. Uh. So that's what's so mad about it. Uh. Really? It all sounds pretty good to me. Jokes. Huh? huh? Saray, I think that's because you're so... So inherently enthusiastic. You guys okay? <laughs> you look kinda... Uh... Mad. They didn't look mad, they looked embarrassed. Let's put it that way. Better relax while we can still camp. Things smell like they're going to get ugly. At least they've got some nice books here. Alicia? Chancellors surrounding the young king do not care. Oh! Chance Chancellors surrounding the young king do not care for the me much. Ah. They think my law standing in the the line of success of succession should keep me um, out of political affairs. Forgive me, I didn't mean to push this on you. Lila, people involved in politics quickly become tainted. If only everyone could be as pure-hearted as Alicia. And you? Is that book floating? Uh, never mind. Forget I said anything. Lord Bartlow is ready for you. To the round table chamber, if you please. Okay. Please wait here, Princess. Why? We were we told like that you. you were to receive different orders. You must die. About Marland? Yes. Please stay here. Fine. <sighs> Alicia? It's about a yet unfinished job. Sorry, but I'm staying behind after all. Woo! This way. I shall guide you to the round table chamber. Will you? But leave the way. <sighs> Did they uh. leave her behind on purpose? <sighs> Not walking. I bet they did. The malevolence isn't gone yet. So, well, how's your day been? Mine's been eventful. Uh, I fought a giant snake. I brought Uno to the, ci to the city. Very interesting day. How's yours been? Hmm. No talkative time, hey? That's fine. I'll talk for both of us. Do you like wearing that suit of armor? It's got to be pretty heavy and quite cold when you put it on the first time. What's with the big tassel at the end? Looks really daft. Short ones would make sense. So am I seeing the king or am I seeing the councillors? Leaving it for, leaving it a surprise. Thanks. It's a great idea. It's what I always like. A good, a good old surprise. You ever get confused with people? Like, he looks exactly like you. You ever get confused? All right, I'll leave you alone. Let's roll. Anything in here? Nope. Hello, people. I am sorry. <gasps> look at that chicken. Oh, look at that food. Sorry to have kept you waiting, gentle shepherd. Please take a seat. Mm. Poison pot pie. Bye. Don't worry. I promise you, it's not poisoned. We simply felt it would be best to be closer to you. Let me introduce you. 
This is Military Chancellor Mathia, leader of the Royal Army. Hello. This is Professor Simon, administrator of the law in Highland. You got a big nose. And this is Archbishop Nathael, the highest ranking holy man in the kingdom. <laughs> you got a big face. <laughs> and last, the man who manifests the will of the king himself. Bartlow. Bartlow. I'm Saray. Thank you very much for your invitation. We have much to discuss. This is all going to be talking, isn't it? Uh... Num, 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 Whoa, Saray, I hope you don't trust them. He does indeed have spunk. That, or perhaps he's just that much of a simpleton. How dare you! It's quite delicious. Though I would have liked to let Alicia taste it as well. What is your relation with Lady Alicia, if I may ask? She's my We're just squire. friends. She invited me to come to the outside world with her. How about we drop this silly game and have you tell us the real story, hmm? She's my squire. Hmm? They're suggesting that you and Alicia are using each other, hatching some sort of nefarious plot together. <laughs> I'm not using Alicia. The Shepherd does not do such things. Oh, he doesn't. I couldn't say. I've never actually seen a shepherd before. Well, you've seen one now. So they doubt you. I figured as much. Believe me or don't, I don't care. <laughs> well, we do care. It would be quite the scandal if the royal family had produced a false shepherd to curry favor with the populace. <sighs> Careful. And so you're asking for proof? That I'm the real shepherd? <laughs> Truth be told, it matters not whether you're real or just a boy in a silly outfit. The issue is that regardless, the citizens are beginning to side with you. Yeah, they are. It's the nature of the people to yearn for some dramatic sort of salvation. An easy way to have their every desire fulfilled. True. The Shepherd in every era has always suffered greatly from the people's grandiose expectations. The common man is but a fool and a cur. It's an unfortunate observation, but that is the reality of it. Reality. But in fact, it is for that very reason that we need you. What do you want me to do? Me? Why me? I will be perfectly frank with you. We are asking you to work under us, Shepherd Saray. Oh! As the Shepherd who would protect Highland, we want you to reinvigorate the people, boost their morale. Doing that anyway. The rampant disasters have rather dampened the people's spirits lately. It's very unfortunate for the Council. Those ignorant fools. Right when we're on the brink of war with Rollins. Who? We will reward you handsomely, of course. Ooh, money. This is your advance. If you're really all the rumors say, I hear that you're quite interested in ancient ruins, yes? I am. Were you to side with us, surely this would be sufficient to facilitate your explorations and archival activities, would it not? There's no point in siding with Princess Alicia. The princess is to be transferred to the city of Marland, where the epidemic yet thrives. They're sending her to a plague town? Surely even our spirited Princess Knight will learn her limits after toiling in such a star-crossed locale. Well, that's where I'm going well, Of next. course, if she herself were stricken with illness, I suppose she would have bigger things to worry about. <laughs> <laughs> so then, Shepherd Saray, there's nothing to even think about, is there? Yeah. I refuse. Yeah. Darn. Guess they weren't the type you can sit down and talk with after all. Probably better this way. Proud words from a false shepherd. You and Alicia will both learn the hard way what comes from crossing us. Bring it on! What's with that Wait. smile? 
What Little on lady. earth is going on here? What are armed guards doing in the palace? These are Lord Bartlow's orders. Aw, oh, yeah. Lord Bartlow, what is the meaning of this? Stand down at once. Nice castle, but we're done here. Let's go, Alicia. I can fulfill my dreams without your help. And the same goes for Alicia. Indeed it does. Death to the knave shepherd who deceives the people! Stand back, Alicia, or you'll get hurt! You Ready? How's this? Don't you think you're overdoing it here, Saray? Saray has just gotten too powerful. I am God! Ready? No escape! Be gone! No escape! It's over! Oh, they're all on me, are they? Bang! You have to hold back a bit. No, I don't know that I can. We just can't go on like this. Yeah. This power. Could he truly? Lord Bartlow, we will forgive this transgression. In exchange, you will never threaten the shepherd again. Am I being clear? <laughs> Impossible. He'll plunge the kingdom into upheaval. And if by any chance oh, he were to fall into Roland's hands. <laughs> the fox is back. Is he? I don't know. That clan is though. I'd be more worried about your own neck if I were you. Who are you? Scattered bones. Assassins! Yes. That man approached us, and tried to hire our guild to murder your princess here. <gasps> Are you Fox saying failed. Lord Bartlow was plotting to kill Alicia? D don't be ridiculous! <laughs> he says we're liars. Should we kill him? Yes. <gasps> yes. Enough! I beg of you, please stop. The Kingdom of Highland needs this man. <laughs> You're all you're made out to be. Listen, and listen well, Bartlow. We do not kill against our own honor. Understood. Why? He's fine. They didn't kill him. <coughs> I'm old. Not your usual assassins, are you? I'm impressed they snuck into the palace. Apprehend them! They're the conspirators! Not good. Thanks to you, our work was quick and painless. Here's your reward. Follow us. Sweet! 